Hello everyone. The poem we are going to deal today is After Apple Picking. It is a poem written by Robert Lee Frost. And first here are the lines of the poem. My long two-pointed ladders sticking through a tree toward heaven still and there is a barrel that I didn't fill beside it. And there may be two or three apples I didn't pick upon some bow. But I am done with apple picking now. Essence of winter sleep is on the night. The scent of apples I am drowsing off. I cannot rub the strangeness from my sight I got from looking through a pane of glass. I skimmed this morning from the drinking trough and held against the world of hoary glass. It melted and I let it fall and break. But I was well, upon my way to sleep before it fell. And I could tell what form my dream was about to take. Magnified apples appear and disappear, stem end and blossom end, and every fleck of russet showing clear. My instep arch not only keeps the ache, it keeps the pressure of a ladder round. I feel the ladder sway as the boughs bend, and I keep hearing from the cellar bin the rubbling sound of load on load of apples coming in. For I have had too much of apple picking. I am overtired of the great harvest I myself desired. There were ten thousand thousand fruit to touch. Cherish in hand, lift down and not let fall. For all that struck the earth, no matter if not bruised or spiked with stubble, went surely to the cedar apple heap as of no worth. One can see what will trouble the sleep of mine, whatever sleep it is. Were he not gone, the woodchuck would say whether it's like his long sleep as I describe it's coming on or just some human sleep. So these were the lines of the poem. This poem actually is written by the great poet Robert Lee Frost. Uh, some lines about the poet. He's an American poet and he's famously known for some of his poems like uh, Stopping by Woods on a Slowing Evening. He deals with themes from rural life in New England, USA, using the setting to examine complex social and philosophical issues. Uh, his uh, important poetical works are A Boy's Will, written in 1913, North of Boston, written in 1914, Mountain Interval, written in 1916, New Hampshire, written in 1923, Collected Poems, 1930. These are just a few to name. And as a popular and often quoted poet, Frost was honored with the prestigious Pulitzer Prize four times. His poetry is largely traditional in terms of meter and exudes lyrical grace. This poem, af After Apple Picking, was published in the collection North of Boston. It is a well-known poem on man's encounter with the natural world, proving the dilemma of his existence. Here, the poet gives his reflections on boredom and drudgery in the aftermath of the task of apple picking. Uh, the work varies the author after his apple picking, is, and the apple picker is unable to enjoy his life amidst the pristine beauty of nature. He is trapped in the utilitarian ways of modern civilization. This poem is composed in free verse. The poem also is remarkable for its mood and intensity. It is also an antithesis of modern civilization and it is marked by the culture of excessive work for the increasing material gains to no end. So here are these, some of these are the uh, poetic devices which are used in the poem. So I will be discussing them for you. And uh, to mention the poetic devices, the poem is actually rich in pictorial quality. Images like my two point, sorry, my two, my long two pointed ladders sticking through a tree, every fleck of russet showing clear, the rumbling sound of load on load of apples coming in, and so on suggest sensuousness. It is comparable to, you know, John Keats' sensual imageries in his odes and many long po longer poems. The poem has been composed in free verse with random usage of long and short lines. 
The, then there is also the frequent use of the pronoun I and the adjective my foregrounds the introspective mood of the narrator. Here it is the poet and uh, the poem after picking uh, after apple picking is, is also comparable to the lyrical composed by uh, William Wordsworth, the solitary reaper. Uh, it is the lyric. So what is a lyric? A lyric is actually a short reflective poem dealing with a personal theme. So over here we see that the poet Robert Frost is mentioning his own personal experience of apple picking. Thank you.